So I want to introduce to you my friend Emma. I have known Emma for several years and the story of God in her life um, is such a great testimony. Um, Emma, why don't you just tell us who you are and where you came from. Salam arz mikoyam be Pastor Dayan Azizam. Man Emma Shahnavos hastam az Iran miyam va da khidmayetun hastam. And Emma, we have seen the testimony of God's provision in your life. You have told me your story from Iran to Turkey to Canada and how God has been so faithful to you. Can you tell us a little bit about God's faithfulness in your life since you moved to Canada? Bale, zamani ke man be Isai Masi 20 sal pish iman awardam خداوند سفر عجیبی با خداوند داشتم و قدم می زدم با خداوند خداوند خیلی کمکم کرده خیلی مجزه ها تو زندگیم دیدم تو ترکیه هم همینطور خیلی سختی ها بود ولی خدا هیچ وقت منو رها نکرد تا به امروز که تو کانادا هستم و بازم تو اون سختی ها هستم هیچ وقت خداوند منو رها نکرده و همیشه بفادارانه کنار من هست و حسش می so Emma, what are some of the specific things that God has done to provide for you as you came to Canada? Um, you didn't know the language, you didn't know the culture, you didn't have jobs, but God has provided for you. What has he done for you? Yes, when I came to Canada, I didn't have a job, I didn't have a job, but همیشه می گفتم خدای همونطوری که تو ترکیه کمکم کردی اینجا هم کمکم میکنی و دوستای خیلی خوبی رو جلوی رای من گذاشت خداوند و چه دوستای انگلیسی چه دوستای فارسی زبان جلوی رای من گذاشت که من بتونم با فرهنگ اینجا با کلیسای اینجا و با آداب و رسوم این اه، اه، کانادا بخوام آشنا بشم خدا خیلی کمکم کرد Emma, I have seen God work in your life. I have seen him provide for you and by your own testimony, as you have shared with me personally, how God provided for you ever since you turned your life over to him. And I've seen him do that here in Canada. Uh, when you received from the food pantry, you received from the car ministry. But to me, the coolest thing is that you are a generous person as God has been generous to you. And even when you are struggling, you still give to other people. I've seen you at the food pantry, um, take excess food and fill your van and say, I have friends who are in need, I wanna go bring it, I wanna go share it, and you do that. But not only from the excess of the church, but also from your own personal life. And you've told me how you've helped people back in Iran or when God prompts you to give to someone else, you just do it willingly because you know that God will replenish, God will fill your cup again. And so to me, you are an amazing testimony of God's grace and God's generosity. So thank you for that. <laughs> این تو خون من عجیر شده یعنی دوست دارم که همیشه کمک کنم در اوج سختی های خودم چون خود من تو کلامش میگه وقتی که دو تا پیرن داری یکی رو بده اگه قرار با کسی داری قدم میزنی بیشتر از حد خودت قدم بزن و من سعی میکنم که این کار رو انجام بدم سعی میکنم که مثل مسیح زندگی کنم خیلی دارم سعی میکنم خیلی اشکالات دارم خیلی موقع اشتباه میکنم ولی همیشه از خدا میخوام که خدای اون چیز حقیقتی که تو میخوای که تو رو خوشنود کنه و تو رو جلال بدم صد جلوی رای من قرار بده و امیدوارم که لایق اون کار باشم و بتونم اون خدمت رو بکنم به مردم